there are a lot of games that I play on Twitch, but there are some games that I play uh, in my off time. One of them being Destiny 2. Love it or hate it, uh, I actually love it. <laughs> it's one of those games that I've been playing for years, to be honest with you. Um, and they do something, Destiny, Bungie does something that I haven't seen any other game do before. My name is Mr. 27, welcome back to the channel. So, there are certain triumphs and achievements that you can complete in Destiny 2 that will allow you to purchase real-life items to commemorate some of those achievements that you've done. Uh, some of the things that I like to collect from it are seals. Uh, I have a collection of seals right behind me in a shadow box. It's kind of hard to see on camera, but I've got about seven of them, and I'm adding two more to my collection today. I got them the other day, I've been saving them for this video, and I figured we can open them up together. Now, let's start off with the Realm Walker seal. They come in this nice plastic container thing. They actually box these up really nice this time around. So the other seals that I've received, they come in like the little bubble envelopes, which like I'm not a huge fan of, but whatever. These actually came in boxes and I was like, yeah, that's great. <laughs> like, that's nice. At least they're protected, you know, um, given that they're like $23 each, which isn't a whole lot, but it's, it is a lot for a pin. But honestly, the quality to me is worth it and I'll show you why. So these are completely sealed. I have yet to see them and I figured we could look at them together on camera. Um, this one is the Realm Walker seal. So you gotta open up the plastic. It's kind of loud, sorry. I'm just gonna throw the plastic somewhere. Get out of here. I don't need it. And it comes in a nice little clamshell box. So you've got a sleeve on the top of it and you take the sleeve off. And you've got the nice clamshell box. It actually has a print of the seal itself. And on top of that, they send this little card that tells you a little bit about the seal. Um, and basically, congrats, right? So it says, congratulations. If there exists a place in the universe that makes its legend in the faltering footsteps of travelers who have lost their way, it is spoken about with an asterisk, a footnote, and a reference to you. The Shattered Realm is one of those places, but you, Realm Walker... You were born of stars, and this is your home. Let the seal remind you that when all was lost, you found a way. Kind of cool. I, I really dig these little notes that they send along with them. I think it's like a nice little thing that helps immerse you into the Destiny lore, into Destiny itself. I think it's very cool. So the box itself is like covered in like felt-like material. I don't really know what to call it, but it has that nice print of the seal itself. And then inside the box, you have the actual seal, which is kind of hard to see in this lighting, but there you are. Uh, it's a very nice uh, little collector's item. I'll show you what it looks like on the back, too. So you have to take out the little center uh, insert right there. There's little pins that are holding it in because it's technically a pin. I call it a medallion, too, because it's kind of both, honestly. It's a pin medallion. Put the little pins back on it. There you are. On the back, it just tells you Realm Walker. It tells you, it says Bungie, all that kind of stuff. Uh, but the front has a nice little display of the seal itself. It's got some weight to it and actually feels like a quality piece. Uh, these are some of my favorite things to collect from Destiny 2. Um, and I think it's just a cool little way to commemorate some of the things that you've done in game. Now for me, I used to display them in box. I used to leave them in the box kind of like this and leave them kind of setting up just like that. Obviously, it's straightened up a little bit more, but as of late, I've been putting them in that shadow box behind me, so that's exactly where this one is going to go. All right, let's move on to the next seal. This one is the Dead Eye Seal. I'm really excited about this one. This one was a very grindy seal to get. It required you to get so many kills with so many weapons in, like, Crucible, in PvE content. There was a lot of stuff behind this seal, but I had a lot of it completed from my time playing the game, but some of it you had to complete when the seal released but we got it done we got the seal and we're going to open it up to today and the plastic's off Ugh. doesn't matter got the little sleeve on the front and you've got the card with it as well so you got the little clam box with the little uh, emblem very nice and this one says congratulations just like the last one uh <laughs> When called to face the most powerful foes in the universe, you walked among, uh, among the countless weapons in your vault and you used them all. You are the tip of the spear we follow into darkness. You are a dead eye, and doubt will never find purchase in your steady hand. Enclosed is your commemorative seal. May your opposition recognize it and depart the battlefield before it's too late. Very cool. 
And then here is the seal itself. I like this one. This one's a little bit more simplistic than the other ones that I've collected, uh, but it's definitely one of my more favorite ones. Very neat. Sorry about the shaky camera, everybody. Let's take a look at the seal itself. Got to take it off the little backing thing. Put the little pin covers back on it. And there you are. On the back it shows the, it says Deadeye and says Bungie on it. And on the front you've got the seal itself. Very nice. Like I said, I just picked these up the other day. Uh, definitely one of my favorite things to collect in Destiny 2. And I figured I'd share them with you today in this video. If you enjoyed this content, let me know down below. Like the video, subscribe to the channel. All the help is deeply appreciated. If you want to see any of the other seals that I have in the background, uh, which I can list them as well if you would like, um, more, if, if you want to see them up close, if you want me to read the card on them, I can do that. Just let me know in the comment section. If you want to check out any live content, check me out on Twitch. It's twitch.tv slash Mr27Unbreakable. We typically stream Monday, uh, not Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, and Friday at 9 p.m. EST. We would love to see you there. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you again in the next video.